I was still looking with an interest on in loan. But it has a different form formats for which they ask that the this particular adjustment. Let's look at how they asked it here. Um, you are provided with pre adjustment trial balance from 28 February 2018. I'd loaned W Pool Bank, it was 124,800. Uh, and remember again, uh, this is the closing balance. This is the close balance in a trial balance, right? Whatever you're given the trial balance in terms of the loan is the close balance after deducting all the repayments out during the year, right? Then uh, it says adjustment the loan statement from WB Bank reflects the following right? uh, WB Bank loan statement on 28 February 2018, that uh, at the same date. Balance at the beginning 210,000. Repayment during the year including interest 85,200. Then interest charged or capitalized, uh, there's nothing. Then balance at the end. So it's the same, you know, mostly it's the same uh, way you calculate. So if I say this 210 minus the 85,200, I'll get this closing balance because that's exactly what we did. Hi, that's 210. Thousand minus eighty-five two hundred. I to get one twenty-four eight hundred. So that's the balance that we have. We just subtracted uh, what we paid from what uh, we had at the beginning. So at the beginning we had two ten. Right. Then we subtracted eight five thousand two hundred that we paid uh, to the bank, and uh, we were left with what. 124,800 but uh, on the bank side every month they're charging us interest you can't charge ourselves interest so every month they're charging us interest so we'll see the interest on the statement so to calculate um, the interest um, you know that was copy last year uh, is the difference between the loan statement closing balance and our loan closing balance so uh, the interest capitalized will be 150 minus 124,000 right so this will give you so 124,800 right uh, this this works right uh, just just be careful how uh, this works when there is no additional interest during the year, right? And it works when uh, there's a single amount of interest, right? But if you have different interest, it means you need to use uh, this table to calculate. Uh, okay, I'll show you how to calculate. It only works uh, when you've got maybe, you know, different, um, only single interest, single loan uh, that you, you have. I just be careful on how you apply that. So uh, that 150, Minus uh, 124,800 is 25,200. So your interest will be 25,200. And the other way, if you are given, let's say, maybe the different interest, you cannot uh, use uh, the amount that you are given there because remember, maybe the interest rates are different. So just, just, just be, be careful there. Right, uh, you rather say this minus this, then uh, minus this, you get this here. Right, uh, so you subtract uh, to 10. Uh, you say to 10 minus 85, 200. Then you subtract the closing balance. This should give you the same amount. 
I so just uh, to make sure you can like read and understand what the question is saying. I hope uh, this uh, this helps you, and if it does help you, please uh, do share with others. You might never know who it can help as well. At the same time, please uh, do subscribe and like this video and share it with others. Thank you.